What recommendations should be given to patients with idiopathic calcionephrolytiasis to prevent strong recurrences? The most important is always to increase fluid intake to get a high urine volume. High means at least 2, if not 2.5 liters of urine regularly distributed over 24-hour urines. On the other hand, you have to avoid high oxalate concentrations in urine, which you do mainly not by reducing oxalate intake because this is almost impossible. So many products contain oxalate. So what we are recommending is when you ingest oxalate-rich products, we give the patient a list, then you have at the same time to ingest calcium so you can precipitate calcium oxalate in the intestinal tract and oxalate is not absorbed and not being excreted in the urine. The other thing is that you should reduce your acid load in the diet, which means you reduce meat, fish, poultry to at maximum one serving a day and increase alkali intake, vegetables, salad and fruit, which increases your urinary citrate, the best inhibitor of calcium oxalate crystallization. And uh, uh, what medications could be tried? Uh According to evidence-based studies that have been performed, there are basically two. There is thiazides, diuretics, and alkali citrate, mainly potassium citrate. I would say they are more or less equivalent according to what the results of the, pres the available studies have shown. But there is now going an ongoing a new trial in Switzerland on thiazide, so we are very much looking forward to the results of these. But otherwise, they are more or less equivalent.